Welcome to this uh, Windows and Computer channel and um, I want to do this uh, little video because I get a lot of requests that uh, people are a little lost on where they are and I want to explain where you are actually. So if you haven't done anything, changed anything on your PC Okay, you are on either the majority of you still or on one of the 2019 versions of Windows. And to know where you are, simply go into your search box, type Winver, W-I-N-V-E-R, click the run command for Winver. This little window here is going to tell you where you are. If you see that you, if you're on like one of the builds of last year, you will see that you are either on the May or the November 2019 update. So that's the first thing you need to know. You'll be on 18362. something or 18363. something. These are the version numbers or the bill numbers for one of the two versions. 18362 means that you're on the uh, May 2019 update 18363 means that you're on the um, November 2019 update. So you're on one of the two versions of last year. The majority of you out there are actually on one of those versions right now. You're about 80 some percent there. So most of you watching this will be in that version. So you know now where you are. Some of you have updated to the May 2020 update. And the May 2020 update's build number is 19041. Okay? 19041. That is the May 2020 uh, update. Okay? The May 2020 update has that build number and you know that you've updated to this latest version with this number now the um, problem that uh, some of you have and I've seen it because some of you have come back to me saying um, wait a minute you know I haven't done the the registry hack that you were shown in the video and I do have the new look and style of the start menu and I'm wondering why uh, and a lot of you think well you know then it's it's already there even in the May 2020 update well no it's not if you have not done the registry hack you don't have that new start menu style and that is only available to those on 20H2 the next version this fall if you see that you're on bill 19 zero four two you're in the beta ring of insiders and you are getting that it's important to note that when you are on the insider program and you could see this by going to settings by going to update and security and clicking windows insider program you will see the rings where you are probably will say the beta channel there's one thing I want to tell you there's a button here you see restart now this is because I opted out of the insider beta ring by putting the switch at you know remove me from flighting if you have not clicked restart now in this panel you are not yet out of the insider program and even if you restart from the start menu, you are not out of the Windows Insider program. You need to click the button Restart Now under Windows Insider program. I suspect some of you have done the steps necessary to remove yourself, but have not clicked the Restart Now from that panel. If you're on 19042, you are on the beta channel and you are testing the future of Windows that's coming this fall of 2020. So that's important to know that. 
And last but not least, if the bill number you see here is 20,000, 20,170, 20,175, um, you're on the dev channel. You're in the testing of Windows really far away of features for 2021, for example. So that is also an insider ring. That's important to know. Now, if you realize that you're on an insider ring, the beta or dev channel, what do you do? If you're on 1904 and you want to opt out because this is the next version, you're in luck. What you could do is go into the Windows Insider page or setting that I just shown you in the settings app in Windows Update and uh, Windows Insider program at the bottom left. Opt out by the little switch that says you can opt out of flights and click that restart button. You will be on the next version of Windows. You're okay, and when it's released officially, everything should be fine. If you're on the build numbers that are 20,000, you're on the dev channel, the only way you can remove yourself from that channel is to take uh, the media creation tool in the Windows uh, 10 page and do a clean install of Windows 10 on your PC. It will be the only way that you'll be able to get back to a regular version of Windows 10. When you're on the dev channel, there's no way out. It's really just you have to clean install using a uh, image of Windows 10, um, unfortunately. So um, I hope this clears up because I kind of see a lot of people that seem to be a little lost as to where they are. And I have to agree Microsoft doesn't make it easy to understand where we are at the same time. So, quickly, if you see build 18.362, you're on the May 2019 update. 18.363 on the November 2019 update. That was released last year. 80% of you are probably there. Then you could be on 19.041. That is the May 2020 update. That is okay. If you're on 19.042, that is the next version that's coming up this fall. That means you're on the beta channel of insiders. And if you see 20,100 and something, you're on the dev channel, which is another ring. And if you want to get out of there, like I said, the only way to do it is to uh, reinstall Windows with the uh, current image of Windows 10 in the uh, Windows 10 download page. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.